Ready? You ready? Oh, uh, 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 let me hit record. Let's get you guys, we'll get you guys your drinks and we'll start up, man. Let's start yeah, sure. We'll start up. We don't have to wait for the drinks. All right. Well, are you guys ready? <laughs> yeah. All right. Let's start with Love of the Mountain. I got I just, I get, I get to do the introduction. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Sunday morning, it's the Hen House Prowlers. Uh, <laughs> song on it uh, and we're gonna do one written by Mr. John Goldfine here on the bass yeah give it up for John yeah. 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 I know we don't but <laughs> this, is, bass player, this is called Fool's Carnival Song one, two. I was following 
but she never came around. I can guess your birthday. Just give me a couple dollars if I'm right. And if I keep on guessing, I might make it to Gibson Burr tonight. Let me guess your weight.
jailhouse, wasting my poor life away. If I was on some foggy mountain top, I'd sail away to the west. I'd sail all around this whole wide world. song here written by again by Mr. John Goldfine. This is off our last album. Uh, this is called Breaking New Ground. Gee.
Please, while your hands are warmed up, his, <laughs> his first day was yesterday with us, Todd Livingston on the Dobro. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm so good on that thing. Shucks, that's nice. <laughs> Two days, that's a good run. <laughs>
trail. If he catches up with me, I'll swim. I got a wife and Chino, babe, man in Cherokee. First one says she got my child, but it don't look like me. Said I'm gonna, gonna take my time. Friend of the devil is a friend of mine. I'm at home for daylight. Just might get some sleep tonight. Trash to the blue dumpsters. This has been a public service announcement. It's better than don't take the brown ants. Hold on, Bob! In the 60s, it was don't take the brown ants. Now it's. You don't want to throw your trash in the red dumpster. Oh! 
also on his second rodeo today. Just uh, not played his. Rodeo. Yeah, it's not his first rodeo. Fresh it's his second. Fresh played his first show, first set with us yesterday from Chicago, Illinois, on the guitar, Aaron Dorfman. <laughs> And uh, I'm about to sing a song off of these guys' new album, and it's uh, appropriately titled Drunk Again. <laughs> John wrote that we haven't done in a while that uh, I didn't like at all when we first heard it because I thought it was a tribute to John Bo Bon Jovi. And then we found out that John's like one of the biggest Bon Jovi fans ever. <laughs> it, was, it was hard to I miss. Respect I respect the mean, man. We got, a, we got a brand new sprinter and every, every time we were uh, halfway to our destination you could hear John mutter under his breath. 
This is called Slippery When Wet. Three, four. Darling, got a long way to travel, but we haven't got there yet. Caution, slippery when wet. Well, it was just another late night, drinking at the saloon. Might have been the last of May or the first of June. Catch our show at the um, the Cascadia stage. Yeah. Does anybody mind if we play a song that we played there? Sure, we can do that. Uh, I was gonna suggest we do the other African tune. Yes, awesome African tune. Uh, so this let's, is let's let's take a poll, huh? You wanna take a poll? <laughs> No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so your choices are Uganda or Nigeria. Let's hear it for Uganda. Uganda. <laughs> and Nigeria. <laughs> this man really wants to chop it. <laughs> this is the only cover on our new album. 13 original bluegrass songs and a uh, Nigerian pop hit. That's what our new album is. It's not a joke, why are you laughing? They're all G's, C, and D, they're all South. That makes the CD, what, 25 minutes? Two, three, four.
boys, I live like family. Hey, I know they lie. I know they lie. There's nothing stopping me. She did feel my swag and I get money. I did try my best over somebody, cause I'm living life. It's true, they make me high, 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 high. I didn't feel this, baby. You know I believe this girl now. Die, I, die, I. If you see this, baby, tell him, say, she must try my money.
figure, but if you couldn't get enough of that song, it's on the new album. Don't be, uh, don't be shy. <laughs> Come talk to us about it. We'd love to tell you about it. Did you bring any merch to sell? I've got I'm some CDs. sure yeah, we have, have some CDs. CDs. Well, don't you be shy. You can talk to me. I've already got one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, that's you can talk to us about it. I don't know if we've got any, but we'll tell you all about it. We've got CDs. Us. Talk to Max. <laughs> If you can't find him, he's wearing the uh, that card St. Louis Cardinals hat. It's, it's the ugliest hat in the country. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Says a Chicago Cubs fan. Yeah. Yeah. Giants. Yeah, the, the team's not in Chicago. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think this is the wrong part of the country to talk about Central Division That's baseball. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> Go Tigers. Shout out to me. Jay's not here, is he? Jay's not here. Both on the fiddle. I'm not Jay. From Sycamore, Illinois. Jay. That's, no, that's Dan Andrew. That's when the silence starts. Sycamore, Illinois. I don't even know where that is. 
Uh, well, this is um, this is a song that one of the original members of this band wrote. We still do a lot of his songs. That last song was an example shadow of a man. He wrote that, and um, he wrote a lot of great, great songs. This is one of them. It's called The Drifter. Slow down, enjoy the air in the country. Stop my rambling and settle down. I like to see my old mother before she goes. Patch things up a bit and try to get along. Understand each other the best we can. I'd like to believe that I'm a new man, but I'm a drifter. Lord, I'm a drifter. I wander along down a dark. My feet have grown tired. I guess I'm finally drifting home. I've been slowly winding my way back to Jesus. time and I've gotten pretty old well, I've been greedy and unkind and I'm wretched and blind but I'll be damned if I ain't gonna try to save my soul but I'm a drifter Lord I'm a drifter I want Closest thing we have to a religious gospel number. 
Yep. Happy Sunday. Sunday. This, yeah, this, Sunday morning. This one's gonna make up for it. <laughs> uh, John, John here uh, wrote this song. We uh, we tour very heavily, and John is a, a strange fellow. He he can't. He has a hard time falling asleep uh, without the television on. Usually Sports Center. Um, <laughs> But it means he wakes up at like five in the morning and watches televangelists, or sub subliminally gets televangelists beamed into his head every morning. And this song insp was inspired by those televangelists. Uh, it's not very favorable of them. It's called Soul Saver. Soul Saver! So guys, this is uh, this is really normal for us <laughs> to go in the middle of beautiful fucking woods and be fed 
<laughs> you guys Bloody Mary is to play bluegrass music for wonderful <laughs> listening people. Thank you. Yeah, uh, yeah, it's a normal, normal Sunday for us. <laughs> from from Chicago, this is uh, this is quite the uh, it's quite the sight. Whiskey on no. This is another one off of our new album. Okay, um, so I'm the new guy in the band and I'm not really used to uh, talking very much, but I, I do want to say that this is an incredible opportunity for me. This is day two for me in the band, and this is by far the coolest gig I've ever played. <laughs> But uh, we're going to play a song that's off of these guys' newest album. Uh, it's called Bartender's Fool, and uh, we all feel like we're the Bartender's Fool, so we're going to dedicate this to Lex, who's our amazing, beautiful bartender. Thank you. We're so happy to have you guys here. This is really awesome. Thanks, Thanks so for having much. us. Yeah. <laughs> Running round like whiskey in your head. She do like giving me that smile and a wink. Just as long as I'm buying a drink. I hate to think that she let me near. Between the hours of nine and one, she's serving me a beer. And as the crowd dance the two step to the old country song. You won't find her dancing alone. She gives me whiskey, she gives me wine. Love ain't worth a damn if it's on bump any time. I'll spend the night on an old bar stool. I guess that means I'm a bartender's fool.
you? Congratulations <laughs> on top of the further bus out here. Far away from her. First time. Get used to it. John got married just a couple months ago here on the base, too. He knows what it's like. Congratulations. That was the most nonchalant response to that I think I could ever see. Who got married? <laughs> <laughs> and Lex, Lex uh, performed the ceremony. I did. I did. Oh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. First rodeo. It's first rodeo. <laughs> first rodeo. <laughs> We're going to do this. Oh, go ahead. Well, I was going to say, this is like the best thing I have for a hat, but anyone that wants to help the band make it down the road, you know, you can throw them a few bucks here. And they'll, uh, they'll appreciate that. They're all the way from Chicago. It's their first time at Hornings, right, guys? It is. And if you missed them today, you can fly to Chicago and catch them there, right? That's right, man. So have, uh, throw them a few bucks, help them down the road. Yeah, sure. <laughs> Tell your friends in uh, San Francisco and Reno, Tahoe area, yeah. and Salt Lake City and Boulder, Boulder that we're on our way. <laughs> Thursday. And Boulder on Thursday. High Street Concerts. Uh, Had some lions. <laughs> Only in the summer, right? <laughs> now we we hear it's like seven months of uh, of overcast and rainy to get to this. So uh, thanks for all your hard work. We're paying off the dividends here for the summer. <laughs> We're gonna do a song written by John's wife's father. Uh, his father-in-law. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> We're so. <laughs> he, he just got he just got married, and for for two years we've been say, explaining because you can't say his future wife's father, future father-in-law. So we got so used to explaining it by detail that I failed. Right there. <laughs> so. I, I think you said it right both times. Uh, <laughs> so, technically, it was correct. It was a waste of space and time. Sorry, dear. We should talk about it more. <laughs> <laughs> there a psychiatrist in there? <laughs> <laughs> this is uh this is called Morning Dove. One, two, three. Sorrow, the 
with this uh, this other African tune. Yes. Yeah. If you if you read our if you read our show yesterday you heard that uh, we spent we spent a lot of the past two and a half years in all different parts of Africa with the US State Department. And uh, this uh, <laughs> this year we went to uh, Uganda, Rwanda, Cameroon, Zambia and Djibouti. Uh, all in about all in about five and a half weeks uh, and uh, and we learned this song it's a Ugandan pop tune uh, that's really catchy and this tune actually went viral on YouTube because there's this great video of these little kids dancing to it better than anybody you've ever seen dance uh, there's more than 10 million views on it uh, and we got to perform this song with the guy who wrote it at uh, at the National Theater in Kampala, Uganda, which is a fascinating place. Uh, most of Africa was colonialized and uh, when things started changing in the 50s and the 60s, all the colonial powers left, went back to their countries, and in Uganda's case it was England, and left these grand buildings. And, uh, and they've kind of kept them up to a certain extent, but they're also falling apart. And we played in this massive theater that was used a hundred years ago by the, the English uh, colonial powers to put on shows and, and, and it was just fascinating to be there. All the equipment was really old and it had this kind of smell to it. <laughs> but it was a beautiful place and, uh, and, and people came out in droves and, and Eddie Kenzo, the guy who wrote this song, uh, came out, came up out of the audience and brought the kids that danced in this video, and we had been watching it for months. Like we studied it, and this this thing's viral. It's like a huge deal, and, and all of a sudden these kids ran up on stage and started dancing with us that I saw in the video. Like you know, and, and I'm like trying to play, and I'm like, guys, I think these are the kids. Like, you know, like, so it was it was a powerful, powerful, powerful experience. The only thing was is that we put a lot of energy into learning the words to this song, which is in Luganda. Uh, certainly not a English, even related to English language, and we had to learn it tiny piece by tiny piece. 
and Kenzo felt so comfortable with us that he just got up and sang the whole song. So we not got, we never got a chance to actually say like, look, we learned your, we learned the song. Like we know how to sing this. So uh, we did get one opportunity. We we got paired up with some incredible African musicians while we were there, and they like gave us kind of some uh, a presentation on their instruments, and then we did the same on ours, and we kind of had a mi melding of the minds with these inst these musicians and. Uh, and then at the end of it, we got to play this song for them, and they did not see it coming. <laughs> and there's this great video uh, that someone snatched while we were playing it, and it was, I just remember sitting there playing this song, and they're losing, they're all around us in a circle, there's probably 60 or 70 of them, and they just, they're losing their minds as we're singing their favorite <laughs> song in their language, you know? And I just, I just want, it was one of those moments where you want to pinch yourself, you're like, I can't believe I'm sitting in the middle of Uganda, surrounded by incredible musicians, and they're, and we're singing their favorite song, you know? So not, not, this, not something we ever imagined doing. Yeah. Ow. Awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> so, this is called Sichalos, uh, and it's a very positive message tune. It means uh, don't fear loss, and dancing makes everybody happier. Susana, 
There's yeah, a mailing list somewhere, yeah. yeah there's an email list out. here and it's stick free stickers and koozies and we have CDs available. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah.